Hello Adventures. Our addendum routines for today are horse and hand circles. We'll do three minute horse with three, six, and twelve count on the hands and then reverse. We'll switch to keep body balance. We'll then refer, refresh the four brothers. That'll be logo arms and neck traps. So that'll be about 10 minutes. We'll then do our abs and right leg vertical. So that'll take care of our 22 minutes. We'll also do our nail mat. This should raise our challenge level. Okay, we'll start with horse. So what you want to do is get a nice kind of a little bit of a squat like you almost are riding a horse and then you'll hold your hands up about chest level. Take nice deep breaths. Blow right into that hot soup. So we'll do three minutes. You'll want to start with one or two and this is an eyes closed exercise so close your eyes you know you've hit your timer so eyes closed helps with your patience your focus and balance it also helps with basic determination so just want to relax take nice deep breaths and just blow that soup a little cook, just cool that soup off. Eyes closed. And just kind of enjoy the nail mat. The nail mat increases your immune system. It really puts it into high gear, which is great for the winter and sickness and stuff. So it takes a few weeks to build up tolerance for the nail mat, but once you cross the border, you really appreciate it. It's, it's a great, wonderful exercise. Just take nice deep breaths. Keep your eyes closed. You'll feel this in your quads and in your chest and lats. You'll want to work up to five minutes. We'll do three for our show. Your eyes closed, and nice deep breaths. Sometimes there's a little traffic noise. It's not my stomach. Okay. Three minutes. Hand circles. We're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three, and then six, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, twelve. Well, reverse, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, reverse, one, two, three, one, two, three, six, one, two, three, four, five, 
six, deep breaths. We'll do three minutes. This again you want to work up to five minutes. I do in the neighborhood of five to six minutes. We'll do three for our show. I like to just make the okay sign and just relax like that, but you can put your hands however you want, however you wish. Just take nice deep breaths. It's a great way to double task, do nail mat and logo arms at the same time. All the four brothers right together, boom, boom, boom. After this, we're going to do a neck stretch. Then we'll do one minute abs. I always do three or four minutes, but for the show, we'll do one, just two. Make it part of our routine. Take nice deep breaths. When I feel a little challenge, I like to go horizontal and just straighten out really get good form. You want to finish strong. challenging yet very enjoyable exercise. Okay, let's do some quick neck stretch. Just tap down here, stretch this way with your neck. A little bit of an isometric stretch here. We'll count to 12 three times. Repeat with the other side, just press down, stretch that out. Count to 12 three times. Breathe. Now, cross them, lean straight back, look straight up. Set to 12. Now, just press an isometric stretch. Three sets of 12. Going forward. Going backward. Now to the sides.
Okay, that completes the four brothers. Let's move some furniture. do a quick one minute abs. Normally you want to do three or four minutes. Stretch out with a nice ballerina stretch. Go to the forehead diamond and just relax into it. This is like planking. Nice deep breath. You can add chest exercise, circuit training, stretch those toes out, open up your fingers, do a stretch, you can do a stretch here, 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 and here, all through your chest. So, Majin benching time. Let's get our body armor. Two and a half kilos. Just get it up there. So if we take a nice deep breath, I like to just just put that right hand on that knee and just start pressing in. Just start stretching out that hamstring. Deep breaths. I've been benching for more than two years now. So when I started, this is where I started. So, you know, you you can make a lot of progress in two years. So I always do a warm up, and this is part of it. I am up to 27 minutes now, so I will stay in this position two or three minutes. But for our show, we're gonna do 30 to 60, and then we'll do some insert origin on our hamstrings, both of them. Hold at the top and bottom of your hamstring, 30 to 60 seconds. Again, when you get up to the master level at 20 minutes, you'll be doing two or three minutes. You got two hamstrings, so it's good to open them up. This is my problem hamstring, so I spend extra time on it. And you'll feel the pulse after a while. After, after practice, you'll feel the pulse in there and you'll feel it open up. So that's about 30. We'll do a little flicking and we'll get the other one. Again, nice deep breaths. Of 
course you have your cell phone turned off. You're not going to be doing any texting. You're going to drink plenty of water before and after. You guys know the drill. Let's get our foot down. Like I said, I'm up to 27 minutes, but for a demo here, we're going to do about 10. We have a 23 minute show limit, so. Now, do a little flicking and really tuck in tight. Get your legs strapped. stretch out. So, we'll do a little energy work, Qigong. Raise that left leg. Just grab right here, you're creating a circuit. We'll do 30 to 60. Great position for people who have bad backs. So, if you have a bad back, you might want to spend 5-10 minutes in, the, in this position. Always stay in balance. If you do this for 5 minutes, when you do your left leg up, you want to do 5 minutes on the other leg. Keep in balance. Okay, this is probably about 30 to 60, so we'll put it down. Do some more energy work here, 30 to 60, right there. Press in, three fingers. Going to light up some meridians here. We're going to go deep and light. You'll feel the pulse. 30 to 60. Again, I go a minute. We'll go light, 30. Now, the last bit of our energy work will be just dig right in with your middle finger and your thumb. Get right into this, and that's a nice relaxing position. It will help relax your body. about 30 to 60. Again, when you get into the master level, you'll do two or three minutes of this. When you get to 25 minutes, you reach the grandmaster level. I blew through that, and I'm working on the 30-minute level, and that, I've decided, is lodging emeritus or grand poobah, whichever you choose to call yourself. 30 minutes is very challenging, but I'm at 27 and change, so I'm getting there. Next year you'll know. 30 to 60. That's done. Let's see where we are. We've got three and a half minutes. So, horizontal arms, let's just get right into it. This is the premier position right here. This is what we did all our relaxing energy work for, is to attain this position. This is the one that does the magic. This is probably the best exercise routine you can do right here. Our next show, you're going to learn, learn the rooster, Jinji Du Li, 
rooster stands on one leg. Take nice deep breaths, nice steady breath. Don't forget to breathe. You'll have your music on and rock and roll songs make this go by really fast. It's like one song and boom, two songs, boom. 10 minutes, you've done 30 minutes, 10 songs. Sometimes I keep my arms nice and straight to help build muscle. Sometimes I'll do 30 seconds, sometimes a minute or two. And sometimes you just want to let yourself relax because that helps heal. So you can build and heal. Sometimes I just, I'll start out strong and just let kind of your body do what it wants to do. This really puts total stretch into your hamstring. You want to keep your body in a nice, straight, streamlined position. Okay, wow. Goes by real fast. We'll finish strong here. Do some chest stretch. Release the hands. Well, ventures, that's all for today. Fate to come, please. Remember, specific weekly goals to attain Lodge and Master at 20 minutes. Do a good deed, challenge your routine, and next show is the Four Sisters. Thank you very much.